let's um, go away from America since we've spent quite a bit of time on that today. And let's uh, talk a little bit about news here in Wales. And uh, in particular, Phil, your favorite nemesis, Swansea University. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm laughing because, well, just, it is an incredible thing. Just to put it in context for our American viewers and others, Swansea University is one, is one of the biggest universities in Wales and a very significant university in the UK. Uh, they've had an issue in relation to their business school, the School of Management, uh, when this guy who was in charge of it, called Nigel Piercy, uh, resigned suddenly uh, after a, um, a number of scandals involving him. Uh, his son is there, was there as well. His wife, Nicola Lane, is still there. And uh, they now, so they have got a history, right? They now have a situation where the guy in charge of Mark Clement um, and the Vice Chancellor, Richard Davis of Swansea University, and this guy called Steve Chan, and there are questions about his qualifications, they've all been named in the Welsh Assembly by an Assembly member called Peter Black. Uh, you know, so what is member of my party and a good friend? Thank you. He, yeah, mm -hmm. he, so he's named them, and you get with uh, that, you know, it, it, you get a sort of legal protection, they call it privilege in relation to something like that. So I'm thinking, you know, uh, it's, it's like, why don't they tr why don't they teach out of the frying pan into the fire on the management course there? Because <laughs> it's just, <laughs> I mean, it's just going from one thing to another, it's incredible. So uh, what was the question that, that, that was tabled and how did that work? Well, he tabled, he just said something like, um, can the Welsh government comment about the senior appointments at uh, Swansea University um, in relation to blah, 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 blah. And of course the answer was, no, we can't. Effectively, it's up to Swansea University, it's nothing to do with us. We can't involve ourselves with university dealings. But the fact he said, said it as well is a written question was very important, you know, because the whole thing is gathering pace now, and this unfolding scandal is gathering pace. All because of the work of the I investigators. I'd like to think, yes, <clears throat> it is. The really. I hyphen investigates UK folks, check it out. Because, you know, I mean, we are alone in having done stuff on this, and, uh, you know, do check our website, you know, you can see it all on there. Uh, other, uh, you know, other organisations haven't touched it really. And although they've done the predecessor stuff, you know, like Nigel Pearcey, they haven't done this. And after you just think, well, you know, how big does it need to be before they do something? I'm Phil, but F Phil, what's just recap for me? What's the what's the actual scandal? What's the story? Is it a story about nepotism or, or you know? Previously, it was potentially about nepotism. It, it looks as though there are question marks about this guy, Professor, in inverted commas, Steve Chan. And his qualifications. Now he has qualifications. Uh, he's an associate professor, right? And there are question marks as to whether you can call yourself then a professor, or whether you know he was get got his PhD in a short time when it's meant to be three years full time and six years part time, I think. Uh, and and you know there are question. There is a, a lot of unhappiness there, and I'm getting a lot of information on on the I from uh, sources within the, the uh, university, the business school, saying, well, you know, we've had to go through hoops to get our PhDs, and, you know, this guy comes in, and, you know, he's got his PhD, uh, and what's that all about? You know, there are regulations, and there aren't, they say, they aren't being adhered to. So you're saying he, he, he was fast-tracked, and he didn't go the, through, the, through the proper process just so that he could be appointed by the person who wanted him in that role? Just don't know. We, we don't know. I mean, I've asked. The allegation that's the allegation i've asked the university a number of questions and none of them really have been answered they've they provide a statement which is very long and effectively says steve chan is a great catch for the university he's a professor of or the internet of things or something you know some bollocks <laughs> you know he's got well, a long time if anybody should be a professor it's dario Linares. Yeah. No, not, well, I want to go through the proper um, channels. <laughs> Let's put it that way. But the, the internet, Phil, the internet of things is not bollocks. It's an actual... No, and that, fair, fair enough. I mean, do people do talk about the internet of things. <laughs> There's something like cybernetics and analytical, yeah. blah, 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 chair or such and such 
I, I don't know what it, you know. Well, it, and, in other words, and stay it. tuned. More to come on this, but uh, the ball is finally moving with some yeah, attention. Check it out. Check it out. Um,